I'm Cheryl from Retro Planner Co. In today's video, I want to share a quick tutorial on how to reduce the transparency of your digital stickers so you can use them as backgrounds or just kind of layer them in your digital planner. I'm using an iPad and I'm going to be using, I'm using GoodNote 6 and I'm going to be using the Pages app, which is built in to the iPad. Unless you are a chronic deleter and you've deleted it like I have, then you'll have to go to your app store and search pages and re-download it. It is free. So once you've done that, um, I'm going to show you like our sticker sets. Um, some of them, like the monthlies and the larger sets, will come with some background stickers already at reduced transparency and some select stickers as well. And then the, set, the sets will also include that sticker at full transparency. So, but it's not a perfect system. Um, for like the more vibrant colors, I adjust the transparency down more. And then for the lighter ones, I keep it a little bit darker. But depending on your spread that you wanna use it as a background for, um, it can look kind of busy. So like I'll use this one as an example. So if I were to put this one in my planner, this page has a lot going on, um, and you put the sticker in there, it definitely competes with the background a bit. So it doesn't really make sense for this page. But you can adjust this transparency down to whatever level you want so it'll fit well with the page. So to do that, I'm gonna go ahead and go to one that's full transparency and bright colors. I'm gonna go ahead and click on split screen and I'm gonna search for the pages app, which is this one right here with the little pen. It'll open up like this and I'm gonna click the plus button and just choose blank. And so from here, you can um, either, when you're on that image tool, kind of long tap on it Good notes is being finicky. Tap on it, long press, just kind of drag it over. When you see this little green arrow pop up, you can just let go and it'll automatically add it in. Um, some people have trouble doing um, this on their device for whatever reason. So if that's the case, you can just tap on it, copy, and then long press. Oops, it's because I already have one going on. And paste and then it automatically shows up in there. So I'm gonna cut this one out and we'll just work with this one right here. So tap on the image, use your finger, not your pencil tool, because using your pencil will just bring up all sorts of other options that you don't need. Um, from here, click on the paintbrush tool. And then here's where you can adjust the opacity um, down to whatever you want. I'm gonna move it over a little bit so you can see. So say for this one, like the darker vibrant colors, I want it to be super low because I do not want it to compete with the spread. So I'm going to put this at 20 and give it a try and see what it turns out. Now, if you were to export this and save it, it's going to save it as a PDF or as a JPEG with a white background, and you don't want that. So what you want to do, this is why we have it open in split screen as well, is tap on it, click copy, and then you can just go back over to your sticker book and or even your planner, but I like to save it in my sticker book. Long press, paste, and here it is. And you can even put it like right beside your sticker. So now let's go ahead and close that out and we're gonna copy it, go to our planner, paste, and see how it's just perfect. Um, it brings it in to where you can still easily see, you know, your boxes and everything going on, but it's just faintly behind there, so it looks really good. And that is the super easy way to reduce the transparency of any sticker to use in your digital planner. So I'm sure you can kind of replicate this process if you're not using an iPad and you're using like say a Samsung tablet, you might be able to replicate it in Notes or like Google Docs or something. So if you're able to do that, let me know because I, you know, I want to be able to share it kind of with the group so people can benefit from it. 